crying. From Delray Beach, Florida, yeah. please welcome Lexi Thompson. To the 28 year old from Florida, an 11 time winner, a major champ on the LPGA Tour, becomes the seventh woman to play in a PGA Tour event. Finds a bunker off the opening tee, but a great second to set up a par. And Lexi Anoue will watch her and the other 131 players here. Day one in Las Vegas. Ball above the feet, you gotta choke the club a little bit. Yeah. Coming like a nice strike. And it is Lexi Thompson will have that left for Birdie. Eight and a half feet for Birdie. Yeah, wasn't feeling it with that one. Just gotta relax and let that putter just flow a little bit. All right, so, still a solid par. All right, just gotta be really smart here. Keep it left. That should miss that bunker just right of it. Beautiful quick, shot. Quick tee pickup. <laughs> quick tee pickup as that runs out for Lexi. 164. Might have overdrawn this a little bit, but safely aboard and getting better. Nice work, Lexi. Another birdie putt coming. 63, 64, 64. Lexi Thompson, par at one from the bunker, and then this at the second hole. Yeah, good approach shot in there, and an even better putt, so a great start for her. How about that? Lexi, four out of six fairways hit. This hole, 552. Just needs a good bounce there, and she gets it. That is exactly what she needed. She's back a little ways, but. Kick it back in the gear here at the ninth. That'd be a tap in birdie for Lexi. And she'll go out in 37. Really good. Loudest gallery out there. Two seventy carry. That's where Lexi's probably looking just right at that. That struck really nicely. That's perfect tee shot. That is pounded. Yellow roof peak of the house is where that spine is. So if she can keep it just on the left of that, that's got to turn. Looks like she got just a little ahead of that one. Got a good kick. Anything just short of this green where she is though is actually a pretty simple little pitch. I think she'll take that. 88 feet? I don't know. It's close. <laughs> oh, well judged. All day, really, in her long putts. When we see like a 21-year-old Tom Kim, we're like, man, how is he so polished at 21? Well, that was five years earlier. Amazing. And that's another birdie for Lexi. So she gets to one over. Yeah, from here you can get a little bit more aggressive. You have the right number. Like a little tug again. Oh, not very much. 
That is sweet, pin high, birdie putt on the way for Lexi, trying to make it three for three on the par fives today. Eight feet, seven inches in this birdie putt for Lexi Thompson. Yeah, and then there's no question that these greens have probably slowed down at least a foot in the last 20 minutes. Lexi, just walk us through kind of your emotions and, you know, finally playing in the event. Obviously, mm -hmm. a lot of lead up to it. So what was kind of going through your mind and how yeah. the day went for you today? Yeah, I mean, it's been great so far this whole week. Everybody's been so welcoming and just a huge honor just to be able to tee it up here. Um, there's more to it than just golf. Shriners does amazing things for these kids, so I'm happy to be out here and supporting them in any way I can. Um, yeah, I, I played decent. I had one bad hole and a few iffy shots, but it's golf. It was kind of expected. How happy were you that Kevin hit that tee shot on 17 so you wouldn't face that tomorrow? Um, I mean, it's not like I hit a great shot after him, so uh, yeah, it's definitely not the shot you want to wake up super early in the cold and hit that tee ball, but, um, but yeah, I'll see if I can make that putt tomorrow. Can you talk about how the fan support was for you out there and how much you appreciated all the mm -hmm. crowds following you? Uh, yeah, the fans are amazing. Um, so many people around that first tee and then following those last, those next few holes. Um, it's just great, especially to see those little kids out there. Um, the fans make the game and that's why we continue to play and just hopefully grow it. Can you talk about the nerves on the first tee shot? I, I, was it anything like Solheim or, or oh. any comparison? <laughs> um, I had a little bit of nerves, but not too much. Um, it kind of similar to Solheim. I mean, similar nerves, but that's kind of what you play for. Who wrote the little messages on your bag? Were those Shriners, Shriners kids? Yeah, Shriners. yeah. So I had a plain white bag and gave it to all of them to design and write messages for me. It was really cool. Yeah. After seven and eight, you had a really great two shots on nine. How would you say to yourself on nine tee box before um, mm -hmm. hitting your shots? Yeah, well, I knew nine I could get a birdie as long as I hit that that fairway. I knew I could get three wood up close to the front of the green and make bird there. So um, hit a good drive and just really stay committed to that three wood and try to make eagle, but definitely mm -hmm. take a birdie. Speaking of like the par fives, you, you performed really well on nine and 13. What was it mm -hmm. about the par fives today? I know they're, they're long, so how'd you do that? Yeah, I was able to uh, get to the front edges of them, which was nice. Um, a little bit of a down right to left wind, so I was able to just hit driver as far as I can, get some roll out, and then be able to hit my three wood up to the front edge. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Uh, or one more, sorry. How did you feel after just the first birdie on two? What was, did you feel relief, uh, excitement? Yeah, it was um, it was a very special feeling. Um, you know, I hit a great shot into one, and probably hit one of my worst putts, and then um, hit an amazing putt on number two. So it was nice to kind of have a good stroke there and make birdie on a more difficult hole. Thank you, Lexi. Yeah. Thanks, You're Lexi. welcome. Appreciate it.